Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. In this video I will show you the, yeah, the location of the 8 of those star thingy. So you can open the chest later on the other type of the island, so other view, the past version. This is the present version. In order to get to those 8, for now there are only 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 7. 7 but if you eat at the original version of the island. If you have the other type, just to go to this one, so not in the temple, but the other one. Inside it. And you will be able to change the island into this type. So, once you have the island into this part, let's collect this in the center first. Change the weather into the cloudy day. So, just use an animal character to light up that one. Now use the air current to go a bit upstairs. Okay, here is okay, here is okay. A bit downside here. On this small platform, behind there, all the, there is a star. Collect this one, Starlight uh, Coalescence. This is our first one. After you took this one, jump down. You have to activate those pillars in this order. Pyro, Anemo, Cryo and Hydro. And you will activate this portal. Now use uh, animal character to light up this. Okay. I mean to trigger it and go inside the portal. Doing this, it will teleport you to this place. Really, really cool above the skies. And here you can take those. Um, there are three of them. So one, two, and the three. Just to take this. 40 Prime Gems and... Uh, wow, a lot. After you took this one, just uh, jump down to the center of that uh, place. Go downside here. And uh, when you're here, you have to trigger the Anemo one again to put the weather into Cloudy Day. After you did this, teleport back to this type of waypoint. And now let's collect those. Now you see that uh, those air currents, right? So let's collect those first. Just uh, first of all, use this one to fly up. Okay, into this uh, location. Go down here. You will see one here. Capture. Now, jump down from here, you will see a um, rock. Let me see if I can find it. Okay, here. Just to destroy those rocks. We'll find another one. You have to follow this one a bit. Or you can just use the is air current. Upstairs here you will see that one. You can capture it. Now took this one, jump down from the west direction. Alongside here. I may here you will see um, another one on the wall, you have to touch it. Now just to follow it. This is the last one from the original version of this island. Now the rest are all on the Mona version. And with this one it's only 7, so we still miss one to activate that uh, constellation. There are more than, there are in total around 18 I guess. But only 8 are needed to activate that. I don't know the extra 10. What's, uh, what was their usage? But uh, maybe in future we will not. Just keep follow. And placing water. Remember the day is still on cloudy day. So don't change it. And it will stop and move around here. A bit more. Here we go. 
You can connect collect it now. Capture. Now go down, you will see this Nemo thingy. You have to activate it. Now just follow the air current here. The most top side. You will see another one here. Fly toward it. There is an invisible platform. Don't worry, you will not fly down. As you can see. You will see this platform if it's a raining day. But uh, yeah, it's, it's always here. Let's collect this one as well. And now we have eight of them. You can see eight. So after you collected the eight, just teleport uh, again to this teleport waypoint and uh, come up into yeah here. And let's start to go upstairs. Alright, so Pyro. I said Pyro. Okay. The railing now should stop. Yes, in fact. Let's go climb back again. And you can see, if he's on Pyro, so sunny day, the cloud will disappear and you can see this beautiful sky. So just come here with your 8 uh, thingy, place 1, 2, 3, after you place at least a 3, it will create this um, bridge, which will uh, guide you into the most highest part of this uh, place. Okay, you place the rest 5. Last one. And this chest will be open. Now you just have to open it. And there is a star coming out. Follow this star. No. Careful to don't fall from the bridge. Here we go, there is another Luxurus chest, so let's open this one as well. In Primo Gems this time. There is a one star here, but the sense is... Um, you can take it, but uh, I will not, since it's uh, not... Uh, at least uh, after this is not uh, useful anymore, this item. Downside here, there is another one here, if I remember. I know here. Anyways, just to keep following this star. Remember to don't run too fast, because after a certain point, uh, the bridge will stop... Uh, uh, up here, around the here. You can see now you have to touch it. It will teleport you into this place where it's uh, raining. And from here, just to touch this uh, one time, it will create this really, really beautiful uh, scenario. And you can see this place, really, really beautiful, really good place to like take photos for your character under the sky. So remember to don't finish this part too quick if you want to take photos, for example, like this. Anyways, this is the last chest. Take it. You will get all the items. Now you can keep work here, but uh, yeah, there's nothing anymore. That's all, guys. This puzzle is really, really simple, to be honest. And uh, the most important thing is that it gives you four Luxury chests in total, guys. Four Luxury, luxury chests. So, in the end, the mana is the most rich in, uh, in this uh, event. So, that's all, guys. Hope this video helped you to collect those four Luxury chests and complete that puzzle. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next video. Bye!